All right, so I've learned now that uh, we're calling these unplugged. So these are just these ad hoc, not really prepared, uh, but just like uh, stories to tell and hopefully fun to find a little humor and all of the and commiserate together and other experiences we've had. So, so this one we want to hit on the topic of. Uh, you can look at it a couple different ways. Either not all revenue is good revenue, which I think is an important lesson to learn. But really, that comes down to margin. Uh, and if you're not getting good margin, like revenue that doesn't have good margin is not good revenue. So, Steve, I'm sure that you have at least a story or two about that. And I have a funny, silly one that was an important lesson for me, too, that was quick. But what, what's, uh, what, what are some lessons you've learned around not all revenue is good revenue? I, I think the story of how bad revenue comes in the door is goes like this. Uh, hey, I got this great deal that I can close tomorrow for a hundred thousand uh, dollars. Can I go sell it? And the answer to that is typically better be no, because they would have already sold it if it was in your standard and they wouldn't have asked you because it would like, it, it was fine. And so like, maybe you have what... standards, but you have to find standards by the way. But, but yes. Okay. That, that's fair. Like, yeah. But, but if, if like your gut starts screaming to, you no know, before you've even like heard the idea, maybe my answer is this is the time when you need to just start with no and work to yes. But I'm sure your story will eloquently state that in truth. Well, so, and, and I'm going to, you just made me think one other thing is like, that is one of the biggest red flags that we've learned is that if you ever get a prospect that is coming to you and you have to move quick, like I got to do now, I got to go now, like, and if they don't do any planning now, granted there, there's sometimes exceptions where maybe it makes sense, but like I, I, nearly every time that I can think of where a prospect came to us and they're like, we got to move now. And Oh, I don't have time to do an assessment. I don't have time to have another meeting. You got to do it now. Uh, that is a red flag and it's better to walk away because that is going to be a problem client. Um, and we've learned that lesson where we did work for those people and then they chose not to pay us because that's just how they operate. And we, we should have learned that. We should have realized that by the way they acted, but that yeah. wasn't the point. I was going to say the, one of the silly stories that I remember, and this was an evolution of how we changed our comp plans too relative to not all revenue is good revenue is we used to have goals based on revenue and then we changed them to be based on more margin. Uh, but one of the lessons that I had, and I remember being super excited about this when I was a, a, a newer sales rep on our team, you know, it, it, when we were selling is I remember selling like, it was like a $75,000 sand storage area, storage area network or storage, whatever they call yeah, it. You're really old. Yeah. Oh my God. I'm old. So, um, uh, it's selling a $75,000 sand. And I think we made, just over two thousand dollars of margin so Ooh. i don't even know what the percentage is on that off the top of my head but it's not good and so but i remember seriously being super thrilled because my the way we were looking at our pipeline it this number shot way above where i usually hit back in the day uh and, and but I, we didn't make any money on it so like uh so selling uh, lots of revenue at low to no margin is not good revenue so the lessons are if you don't have standards uh, get standards to find them. And, and, and number two is if you have standards, um, make sure you try to stick with those standards because otherwise you're going to be ending up with, well, no margin, negative margin and no margin. Yeah. yeah. And negative margin. Exactly right. So that's this unplug, but that also segues to the next unplug session. Stay tuned.